Yo, what's up guys? It's Brother Shield here. Today we're gonna test a game which was actually on one of the list of um I think it was men's here. Um and that is Toy Story 3. And yes, there is a Toy Story 3 game for the PS2. Yes, I mean I was shocked as well. I mean I thought Toy Story 3 was only for the PS3 and the Xbox 360. But... <laughs> Turns out there is a PS2 uh, version of Toy Story 2. Didn't even realise it to be honest. Um I think that that was the time when um well PS3 was pretty much the norm. You feel me? Anyway, so we are gonna play Toy Story 3, not two, not one, three. Yes. I was really shocked. Anyway, we're getting a solid um at least around 48 frames per second. Oh, okay, hold on. Too early to judge, right? Just yet. So let the game just run for a bit. So that's a little loading screen there. It's my first time running this, so um I don't know if we can go in game or not, so Again, just gonna just quickly do a quick test and see how it goes. Okay. Pump up the volume. Yep, there we go. Okay. Alright, so far so good. There's hardly any less glitches, but there's still a very low frame rate. We're getting 27 frames per second, although we're not really moving much. Oh, copyright. I uh, forget it though. Ooh, Disney! Oh, <laughs> Kingdom Hearts, man! I just got the feels there. Kingdom Hearts 3 at least. Ooh, glitch! Hurry, guys! Bonnie's back from daycare! Okay, places, everyone! Look at that glitch. Ooh, character models are glitching. 30 frames per second. Ooh, even the... Oh, damn. Wait, does this take place after the movie? Oh, Slinky's still good. Okay. Wait, I didn't even pay, pay attention to Rex for a sec. Toy Story 3. Good game. Oh, yeah, I remember this. Classic days. Uh... Ah... Uh. Dab, yep, let's go for it. <laughs> dab, bro, dab. Do the dab. Okay. So, in just a few minutes, uh, we'll format successful. Yep, again, I'm not really worried about my memory card. It's when this emulator is running full speed, then I'll be a bit concerned. Okay, 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 let's go. Again, 13 frames per second. Oh, yeah, never mind. That was the memory card. Keep forgetting. All right, let's go. Dab. The name is Dab. So again, ooh. Character models are definitely glitch. Uh, they need to fix those texture issues. I don't see any models. Modeling issue. Even some assets as well in the game. Adventure book. I can't see any of the levels. So I'm just going to go by it through imagination. Yes, this definitely needs to be fixed. Okay, we're getting 40 frames per second. Now, hey, at least there are some parts of the game that is not completely gone. Ooh. Okay, we're getting close to 50 at least, or 60. But let's wait until the models show up in the, in the actual scene. Yep. So it slows down. Okay, we're getting at least around 30, close to 30 frames per second. Character models and the textures of the character really need to be fixed. But at least, at least we we can go in game at least. So I'm gonna just play, see if I can do this mission real quick um, before we, um, yeah, let's let's just get on with it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Come on. 
Finally. Huh. After all that, and there's no way it was that long, that short. Playtime that train was with Andy was always so exciting. Buzz. <laughs> there was no way that train was that short. No way in hell. After that money running <laughs> for that long, for almost 10 minutes. Oh boy. Hey. Saves and then it's on to the next mission. Oh, that makes sense. But I wonder if there's a pre rendered cutscene though. Oh. Now that we live here with Bonnie, I can look at my drawings to help me remember everything that's happened. Uh, I can't see any of the drawings very much. But anyways, guys, I'm going to pretty much end the video here. That was just a quick test to see if the game runs. Uh, we can boot into the game. We can pretty much play it. But the game was running around 27 or at least close to 30 frames per second. Not really at full speed. But the textures like Rex here, uh, they, that definitely needs to be fixed as well as the models. Well, we can't, we can't even see any of the the blinks, anything, nothing. We only see the inside. I'm pretty sure it's... Oh, in, in the 3D software, this would be a camera issue, but in this case, is the emulator. So, anyways, guys, um, let me know what you think of um, Toy Story 3 running on um, this PS2 emulator. If you guys um, like it, let me know in the comments below. And if you're new to this channel, subscribe to Brother Shield. And as always, I'll see you on the next video. Have a good one.